What is up guys and welcome to this unboxing video. Uh, pretty excited here. Uh, there's the package. This is the first limited run game that I've ever ordered. So I'm uh, pretty excited about this. So without further ado, let's go ahead and unpackage it. Have my handy sandy, handy dandy knife here. All right. And it opens just like this. Put the knife down so I don't cut myself. There's some nice bubble wrap that I can maybe reuse here. Oh, I see it through there. Can y'all see it? Let's undo it here. Oh, oh, something fell out. First of all, we got this little thing. Count says one ticket towards a limited runs game loyalty reward. Huh. Well there. I'll have to keep that. And this is cool. A limited run card. With I guess this is one of the characters from this game. Very cool. So that's awesome. But here is the main attraction here. There's the back. And here's the front. Yee's Origins. I have still not played any of the Yee's games. I have a few of them. I have a couple on the. Uh, I have one on the Super Nintendo. Wanderers from Yee's. I have books one and two on the DS. I have uh, Yee's Arkham to Pistum on the PS2. But I've never played any of them, and I've heard they're really fun, really great, and it's got really good reviews. Um, this is for the Vita, uh, so I can finally. Add to my Vita collection, which is one game, <laughs> Ra uh, Stranger of Sword City. We're going to add to that right now. And uh, I want to open it right now, because if I don't open it right now, I, I, I just it'll just sit. So I definitely, definitely one that I want. This is one I want to try out, and. This may be the first one I try out because this is Origin, so this is like one of the first in the series here. It's a retelling of the first one. So there we go, there's the box here. So we'll go ahead and carefully open this. Okay. There it is. Tightly packaged, jeez Louise. Smells good, it smells new. What is going on? Oh my gosh. Okay. Alright, so there's the empty box there. And there it is, ladies and gentlemen. The game. Boom. Limited run. Open that in a second. And then underneath we have a couple of little extras here. First up this looks like a poster of some sort. Let's say. Oh that's cool. There is the poster, looking sick there with this giant tower, the two main characters are looking up at. I think you can play either in this game, I think you, play as the, you can play as a girl or the guy, if I'm not mistaken. And then we have a collector's edition art book. So, flip through a few pages here, so, some character art. Your main protagonist. A lot of a lot of cool character design in here, obviously. That's pretty neat. I like that. Have some uh, environments. So yeah, this is pretty awesome. Um, 
But now, without further ado, let's go ahead and open up the game so I can try this bad boy out when I have a free minute, which is few and far between these days. There we go. That's off. And there you go. There's the game. From my experience, it doesn't seem like Vita games usually ever come with a manual. If I'm mistaken, please let me know, but uh, most of the ones that I've, I've looked through at GameStop and everything, I've never seen a manual, That's, which is kind of weird, but anyway. But the important part is in there, it's the game. So, yeah, can't wait to try that one out. But, uh, yeah, my first limited run game, guys. Uh, um... Let me know if you guys are into the limited run or not. I, I, this is my first foray into it, and uh, if I can find some cool RPG stuff like this for uh, like the Vita and stuff like that, I'm, I'm game for sure. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. We'll see you later.